I am now at the Greensboro Airport. I just watched the video. I think I was tired. I think there's something about computers and ID that I did that was correct. I don't really know how far this was all meant to go. As the conversation escalated with all that was wrongful about it, that led me to not give in to ever answering a question. Which could also be foolhardy because of the precedent of what that has meant. I did something right about computers and ID. Something erroneous in reading the human situation. And in looking at the video, how far was this supposed to go? Half of the reason I got out of it has to do with the character of the men there. In Massachusetts, the exact same character led to an opposite outcome. So my radar on people is, is false. Theoretically, what I did was very foolhardy. I was going on some rational concept, but that was the same thing in Massachusetts. I was tired. When I'm tired, I'm not emotional. Instead, I was actually almost very rational if you want to see one side of it. My words were calm and content driven. The emotional part was that I wasn't answering questions, but that's still a rational fact. That would be in direct comparisons. Some part of it is luck. These people were different. It's not the same people. It happened in Massachusetts. Already happened. So I'm very happy to be here. This could have been a hellish, hellish moment of my life. Wherever there is keen insight and valor, it's probably not totally the thing to rely on. My sense of connection to this reality is more simply basic. I was in a situation that was off per what I should accept putting myself in and reacting wrongly, except that's sort of false because I'm here now and that's not what the intent was. Well, it's easy to think of it as, you know, anything you might think of in totalitarian regimes and not democracy. Um, all I kept saying was violence and that the scene there, I still can't make my head work more than that. And I didn't want to show him my driver's license, but I know it struck me off about that. It's an airport, and it's a false, false understanding to show ID. Airports are geared towards ID and boarding passes. That means, that means immediate understanding about, about the line where that happens. Anything before that line is false. I, haven't, I know I react to that. It already bothers me when people outside just ask you for ID. But in the context of the airport, I, I know I know how wrong it seems to me. And maybe my radar on that was correct and led to some stepping back from impetuosity. That's all I can say. I'm just happy to be here right now. And I should change my ways. Half of violence is unintelligible, I think. And that's all I have to take from this.